hello and welcome back to the channel i have a little cold but i'm on my way to go show one house right now it's only a few minutes away from my house so i'm gonna be there in a few minutes um but i did want to just go ahead and do like a little ride with me uh vlog before i get there summer is winding down the kids are back in school um believe it or not kids can be a distraction i did involve them as much as i could um and what was going on so they got to learn a little something about real estate this summer and when i left them at home i left them at home uh so they weren't a huge distraction i am glad to be able to resume my usual schedule and which my turn here i work from my cousin's house all right showing is done and um i'm on my way to run a few more errands um the house is a no-go and um i don't know but this one we're in a tricky situation we're in a time crunch kind of situation uh, so all hands are on deck um yeah this is the part of real estate that is um really rewarding and really because at the end of the day i'm going to get it done at the end of the day i don't care what the time crunch is uh in my mind i'm going to get it done so it doesn't matter what is going on is going to get done now realistically sometimes it just does not work out um either the person doesn't have the credit or can't get pre-approved or whatever or things just don't happen the way you know you think it's going to happen but it does happen you know the way it's supposed to i do believe that everything happens the way it's supposed to happen for whatever reason um but yeah um that one was not the one um, and not it would not work for my client and their family. It was a nice house, but um, it's just getting cold. It's making my voice. Deep. But um, yeah, so we're on to well, not literally right now, but we're on to the next one. Just that fast. Um, they want to see another house. Um, oh wait, hold on one second. So I just showed this house. That is house showing number two. Don't worry about why I have two shirts on. I have one the shirt. I'm going to tank top and I also have on um, <laughs> like a one piece thing here. Um, but yeah, that one is going to be a no-go. Um, and they actually didn't make it to this one. They were running late and weren't going to be able to make it. But I uh, just FaceTimed them so they can see it. Um, the other one that we want to see is actually in their neighborhood. So I was like, there's no point if y'all coming out. To see this one if you're already behind and you haven't left home yet so i'm on my way to their neighborhood now to go see option number and i still have 30 minutes um to do that but uh let's see option number three so this one is not off the list off the list but it also does have um a contract on it already well, let me start my gps all right so i am about Oh, I should go to Home Depot and see if I can find a new fiddly fig tree. I want to go to Home Depot since I have 20 minutes to spare and I'm right here. I think I will. I might be coming home with a new plant. But yeah, so we're hoping that the next one is going to be the one. Um, they're already, of course, familiar with the neighborhood and um, square footage wise is giving them what they want. Um, however, it is missing a garage. Um, so they're not getting everything they want in this house, but, um, they get most of it. They get most of it. So we'll see. And this may not be the one, the one, the one, one, one. I have another obligation later. So maybe tonight I could probably show them the other few that do have garages and we might be able to make those work. Um, but for now we're going to go to Home Depot. Home Depot, hey. And we're at Home Depot checking out the prospects. I came for a fiddly fig, but I don't think they have fiddly figs in. But they do have these little things. So they have this and this one. I'm leaning towards this one because it looks better, I guess. And this one looks a little burnt. But this could be a new leaf. Is this a new leaf? It is kind of curled. I might take my chances with her. I just might. I gave one of my clients a ZZ plant. This one's so big. 
All right, we're going with these two. All right, ready to go. All right, time to go to the next showing. Got my new babies. So my 1245 that I requested has still not been approved. Um, I'm going to head there now. Okay, girl. I know where to go. I got a bus of Huey. I'm about to be. Now I'm going to be late. Now, now, why would I do that? Why would I stop to go get some dang on the trees? Now I'm going to be late. I don't think I'm going to be late, though. I, I can get there in 10 minutes. Let's see. Alrighty, let's do it. Since I get there at 12:48, which I'll get there at 12:45. When the vlog ended, but my um, phone died, and I need my phone to one get me where I need to go, and to open up the lock boxes. So let me let my phone charge. 12:46. Alright, so they want to put an offer in on this house. Third showing, it did end up being like a house hunter kind of thing. One, three showings of the day and they picked the last one. So I'm excited. It's really exciting, especially when you find the house that you're like, okay, you feel like it's the one, they feel like it's the one. Um, the feeling is unmatched. And then of course, once you go into contract and all that. So it's a lot of work to be done. So I'm going to end the vlog right now. Um, I'm going to be on my way home, run my cops and um yeah get them on the contract we're gonna get this house we're going to get this house it is just a few days later um from the showings and the last clips and we're on our way to inspection so i guess i'll update you all on how inspection goes i feel like this has been a crazy little vlog um here we're going from one showing to three showings to under contract on the last one now we're going to inspection um so hopefully everything goes well with this inspection and um i guess i'll just include the results um afterwards or at least you know how we're feeling about the inspection uh, afterwards got the kids with me and Turn i'm gonna left. open up the house and then bring them back to the bus stop so the neighborhood is getting new asphalt this morning so we're all walking together <laughs> to um go open the house up and then leave but at least they'll get some brand new asphalt we had a park at the beginning of the street and they're walking all the way down of course it's the last house on the street <laughs> so the kitties have been dropped off and i'm on my way back to the house for the inspection so hopefully everything is going well um the house was built in 2003 so it's not very very old it's not 30 years old until 2033 but yeah i'll check in after everything is done and uh maybe a little bit during we'll see all right so the inspection is done the inspection went well most of the things on that list were all cosmetic like absolutely um all all cosmetic which is wonderful we are going to request a few items um be fixed none of them are deal breakers um that's the main thing so that's the end of the vloggies oh, oh, oh. that's the end of the vlog i'm gonna wrap it up here and i will see you in the next one Bye. <laughs>